Now, the civil society organizations under HEPS Uganda have decried inadequate access to information on COVID-19 vaccines. This was at the COVID-19 Capacity Building Training Week organized by HEPS Uganda at the Lake Victoria Hotel in Entebbe. Health rights advocates stakeholders have convened a one-week capacity building training organized by HEPS Uganda at Deck Victoria Hotel in Entebbe. The training is aimed at promoting equitable access of COVID-19 vaccines and explore challenges influencing access to vaccines in Uganda. We need uh, uh, aggressive community mobilization uh, for utilizing these uh, vaccines that are taken out of the cold chain and have to be consumed within a very short timeline. They observed insufficient information dissemination and access to genetic vaccine as the major hiccups to availability of COVID-19 vaccine locally. We shouldn't have scenarios where we have low stocks, out of stocks, expiring uh, uh, vaccines because of misuse or disuse. They unanimously resolved to work closely with all stakeholders in advocating for safe and COVID-19 vaccine equity at all levels. Vaccines are real and science has been proven and uh, we are actually here pledging that we are going to work with government through the VAX project to make sure that vaccines are all over the, the country, everyone has access and they'll be able to afford. The program director, Global Health Collaborative, Dr. Steven Nassimi, wants governments in developed and developing countries to ensure equitable access and dissemination of accurate information on all vaccines. So we are saying we want global COVID-19 vaccine equity. So from the people who manufacture these vaccines, to make them equitably accessible, affordably to all citizens globally. Because infectious diseases don't know borders. Executive Director HEPS Uganda, Kenneth Mwehonge, urged developed countries to allow Uganda access genetic COVID-19 vaccines to enable local production. We are here to uh, call upon uh, increased access, transferring this technology uh, to countries uh, that are producing these vaccines to produce more generic versions to reduce the cost but also increase access. The training has been concurrently held with Global Week immunization campaign aimed at sensitizing the public to appreciate vaccination. Sudat Kaye, Robert Boita, UBC News.